Hello my friends, John Bams here and welcome back to Tech It. Well, things are up and running, things are going good, uh, but we've run into a problem. Every single drop of coal that is coming out of our quarry right now um, is being used, is being recycled right back into the engines that are powering it, which leaves no coal for all my machines. So, what we're going to do today is some alternative energy, and I have decided on windmills, because I can kind of plunk them out there and never worry about them again and it will be plenty of energy for the machines we have so let's get right to it and actually the first thing we're going to need is some place to store all that power that we're going to get from the windmills windmills nope but the windmills so we're going to build a bat box all right so uh let's let's see how we do this i've already got all the materials we're gonna have to look up the recipe here wood three batteries wire simple 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 okay like so, um, wire, and our re-batteries. There we go, bat box. Splendid. Now we need our windmills, which is simple, four generators, because we're making four. And four pieces of iron in each corner. Boom, windmills, four of them. Nice. Now the next thing we're going to need is uh, glass, let's see, what's it called? Glass fiber cable. Whoa. Okay. Let's do that. All right. Uh, we're going to need a bunch, so we'll just throw all of our stuff up in here. And you only get four per one. So let's see. Let's go one, two. Oh, boy. We're going to need a lot. <laughs> Bye, diamonds. Oh, I'll miss you, diamonds. Forty. That should be more than enough. More than enough. All right. Now where to put it. Now where to put it. Um... I already moved some machines around here. We got our wire down there. Generator. So I think we're actually going to plunk the bat box right right there. Yeah. I think that'll work. Okay. But uh, we have a problem. This is the output right there. And we need our output, obviously, going into the wires. It's simple to do. So let's give ourselves some room here. All we have to do is take our little wrench here. And there we go. It has changed. The output is on the bottom. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Uh, now we need to run our windmills. Uh, okay. <laughs> I guess that'll work. Uh, sure. So let's start running our... Actually, you know what? Can we, like... Can we stand on this stuff? Hoot! Let me up! Let me up! Hoot! There we go. Ah, we can. Alright, so we're going to want to go relatively high here so the windmills are out of the way of the roof make sure they're harnessing maximum wind power i don't know what do you think does that look high enough we'll say yes then we'll go out one two uh should we go hmm that's three let's see how far apart they'll be we want to spread them out enough i don't know what the actual distance has to be so that you're getting the maximum wind but, um, yeah, I think that's far enough. Now, it's kind of hard to put the windmill down, so we're going to put a block out. There's a floating-looking block, and let's get our windmills. There's a windmill. And one for the other side, and then we're going to go up and put the... Huh! Oh, oh, whoa, almost fell there. There we go. That works. Chop these out of the way. And now we're going to come up a little bit more. And then do the other two in the other direction. So. Uh, five up. I'm not even sure how far we should go. Two. Three. And three the other direction. Two. Three. And put our logs out. Place our windmills. And we should be getting... Loads of power now. Loads and loads of power. Which is what we need. Place the oh. <laughs> That's not where I want you, log. Back off. Hoot, there we go. And bam. Alright. We are rich with power now. Let's go. Let's go see how it's doing. Oh dear, I forgot about getting down. Hoot! Ow! Hoot! Ow! 
Uh oh. What's that sound? Something gonna explode? What is that? Stop, stop! Ah, yes, there we go. It's charging very slowly. Uh. There we go, okay. Before the bat box actually fills with this power, it's gonna branch out and fill these up. So we'll let that do that. And there is our wind power. That That is perfect. Perfect. Hopefully. <laughs> oh, we could also always use the generator as a, a secondary source, but there is one more machine I want to build for this little spot right here. A fun little machine. It's I, I kind of call it like a lotto machine. Uh, so let's see what we need to make it. It's actually called a recycler, I believe. Yes. Oh, we actually need a compressor for this. Oh, man, this is getting difficult. All right. Um, so for the compressor, we need a machine block to start. Let's see what we got for refined iron. I don't think we have any refined iron. All right, we got to refine some iron, throw some other stuff together, and then let's get this other our lotto machine running. Okay, I believe we have what we need now. At least for the compressor. Okay, the first thing we need is a machine block. Sample. And uh, circuit board and stone. Machine block. Circuit board. Stone. Compressor. Now, let's put our little thing there. Compressor. Glowstone. Refined iron. And deer tay. Yes, recycler. Okay. The lotto machine, as I call it. Plunk. Put it right there. Already fully charged. Bat box is getting there. Okay, so the recycler. What does this thing do? It does awesome. And I will show you. <laughs> okay, what we're actually going to do is... Break that out there. And do we have... Which pneumatic tube do we have left? 15... That'll be close. Let's see. Let's see. Whoa! Ah! Ah! Sword! Sword! Ow! Oof! They're always waiting for me outside. Oh my gosh, look at this party over here! You guys kidding? Ugh. You're right by my machine, man. I don't like you, creeper. What? Did he just ignore me? He's like, not even gonna mess around with this guy. Not even going to mess around. Stay away from me. This is terrifying. Okay, so one, two, three. Please have enough. Please have enough. We have enough. Awesome. <laughs> Alright, let's shut this off for a second. And we need to break. We're here. Yep. Uh, yeah, we'll leave that there so we can always switch back and forth anyway. We oh! oh! Oh, oh, that's all. Thank you. Oh, my gosh. I totally forgot. Aha, creeper. Aha. Oh, my gosh. I completely forgot they were off. I almost had a heart attack there. Oof, that would have been my compressor. Or my conde- Oh, man, that would have just been a, a horrendous nightmare. Okay, so... Let's go back inside. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Bam! There we go. So now we can pump stone directly into our recycler. So let's go turn the machine on. Probably should have did that. I always forget that the red power stuff is quite a bit smarter than the build craft stuff. Uh... The buildcraft pipes will just dump blocks everywhere where the red power pipes are, are quite smart. Uh, yep, here we go, here we go. Is it going to work? Yes. There we go, there we go. Okay, so what's going to happen here? Recycler. Every once in a while, we are going to get a piece of scrap like that. And now we will wait. We need nine pieces of scrap. For what we want to do. So let's wait for a nine. And then we will give it a shot. It's it's all free. 
in a sense. You know, uh, oh look, we're up to three. Um, so a lot of you are probably thinking, like, why not just run all that stone into... Looks like something's going back? What's going on here? Oh, it's full, it's full, okay. Uh, you would think, why not just run it into the condenser? Continuously condense. This is why. We need three more, and I will show you why. What we're going to do is we're going to put the scrap in a table, like this. Three more in the bottom. And that will create a scrap box. And if we could get three more pieces here. All right, there we go. Nine. We can make one scrap box now. Obviously, this is something you'll let running for a while. And eventually, we'll even hook up to an automatic crafting table that will just continuously put this together for us. All right, so there you go. You got your scrap makes a scrap box. What do we do with that? We put it in our hand and we right click. And it gives you a random item. In this case, unfortunately, it is some rotten flesh. Um, but the reason this pays off is because every once in a while you'll get something real good. Uh, for example, I've gotten a, a gold crown before. Which sells, sells, which condenses or whatever you want to call it for like 14,000 uh, EMC. Almost two diamonds. So that's well, well worth the risk. Um, yeah, so I'll let that go for a while. I'll stock up tons and tons of scrap and it shall pay off. But, yeah. So we're making progress. We're starting to get rich. Things are going good. Things are going well. And uh, thank you all so, so much for watching. I'll see you all again very, very soon. Okay, now bye-bye.